Ojo, ok. Pinas. Pinas. <laughs> So awesome. This video is brought to you by all my Patreon supporters. Go Team Awesome! Hey guys, welcome to the first episode ever of Mystery Product Reviews. So this company, they emailed me and they said they like my channel and they have a something, a product that I would really enjoy, that would really suit me and that would suit my channel and they'd love if I promote it. And without looking into them, I kind of wanted this to be a mystery. So I thought, hey, why not? So I accepted and uh, they sent me this box and uh, I'm gonna open it. I have no idea what's inside. I don't know what I'm supposed to be promoting or um, doing a product review on. So uh, they didn't give me any money for this. Of course, they just asked me to give me the product for free. Okay. Wow. Uh, it looks like they sent me a hair dryer. Maybe they haven't watched my channel and they don't realize that I don't have any hair to dry. I hope it's not like something sexual. It's nice though, whatever this is. Hello, Moat. It's very kawaii. It's all in Japanese. Ah. Okay. This, guys, is a hair remover. It's a laser hair remover. So here's everything that came in the box. The actual machine from Hello, Moto. Then this manual in Japanese. Cool, these sunglasses a razor and a charger uh, and the dog was not included oh and they have pink and white and I received the pink one so I guess there's a white, white version too and yeah there's the QR code if you want to actually go I'm thinking dot KR means from Korea okay it's very cute so my you will like this I don't know what I'm doing here and I don't want to like burn off parts of my body so I'm gonna get Mayu who's Japanese to help me through this and I'm going to try this out why not but while you're waiting why don't you thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe to my channel because my videos are awesome Aussie awesome also if you haven't already subscribe to my free newsletter it's free and I send it out once a month and it includes links to videos that are not available on YouTube as well as articles about the dark side of Japan the link is in the information section below all right hey guys I'm here with Mayu and she's holding our hair removal laser machine thing Konnichiwa. Mai is very shy, so it took a long time for me to get her to come on, but she's gonna help us. Okay, so we're gonna open this up. Uh, I showed you it before, so let's just quickly open it. Mai, you scatta kota aru? Hajimete? Donna ba shogai? Kyo? Koko? Koko? Okay. So she doesn't have much hair as it is, but um, maybe she has a couple of strands. So we'll like... Just out of Okay. So we're gonna shave that and laser it. I have hair everywhere, but I have like an extra patch somewhere here. So maybe I'll do that part. Kiken pacemaker. Do I wear a pacemaker? No. Okay, don't do it near water, so near in the bath. Okay, warning. Don't use this around your eyes. So don't use it on your eyebrows or eyelashes or, or even your nose. Okay. Koko. In your ears. Okay, got it. Um, places that you've had a sunburn. Okay. No lips. Oh, anywhere where you've had surgery. Okay. Nipples. Uh, like private parts. Huh? Ah, okay. Internal organs area. Huh? Ah, eyeballs, okay. Como. <laughs> Danseki. Asko, okay. Penis. Penis. <laughs> so basically, don't use it on your tender parts. Huh? Uh, anywhere where you have like um, freckles or warts or zits or birthmarks. Yezumi. Or tattoos. Okay, so no, not on tattoos. Okay. So people who are like 
sick, have little, really bad like heart conditions or diabetes or stuff, shouldn't use it. This says a whole bunch of stuff that you should not use it on, but if you want more details, I guess you can research or contact the site. Oh, it's green. It's like Terminator green. Mm. Maple, it's okay. Okay, one, the places you can use it. Oh, okay, Basho. Mm. Okay, legs, armpits. Ude. Ude, okay. Arm. Bikini line. Bikini line is okay. Ah, uh, uh, okay. Ah, okay. The first month. First, first month was one, one week. Okay, for the first month, you do this three times a week. Okay, for the second month. Week one. Ah, uh, once a week. Okay. After that, about once a month. Okay, so basically don't wear makeup or anything at the part you're using, right? Okay. Okay, shave with the shaver before you use this laser they don't use any kind of like hair removing wax or cream. You can't really tell your skin tone using this graph, so it would be nice to have a color one of this. But I'm gonna guess this is like Mayu and this is like me around here. Plugged in, and now there's like this red light. Okay. okay. Hold it down, hold the power button for more than three seconds. One, two, three. Oh. Whoa. Oh. It suddenly started making a noise. And now this display came up. Okay, next. So we'll just start with level one because it's our first time. And it says you should test. So plus minus button. It We're on level one. If you press it again, level two, three, four, five. We'll go back to level one. First, we have to shave the part that we want to get off. As you can see, Mayu has hardly any <laughs> um, hair. But she's gonna shave that area, those are. So she's gonna shave it quickly. Okay, you should use shaving cream, I guess. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay so she has goggles on. At a 90 degree angle and right up to the skin. She's scared. Hi. <laughs> she can't. Okay. You can do it. Do that, huh? No feeling, right? Mm. Oh, like a, you continue. Count to Yeah, I went for... Oh, that's how many times you can do it before you need to charge? Mm. Oh, wow, 500,000. Okay. Does it hurt? Itai? Okay, so it doesn't really say how many times to do it, but you just have to keep. Don't like himachi, atatakai. Nothing? No pain? No feeling? Atsuimo? Okay. Zero. Zero pain, zero feeling. It doesn't even feel hot or anything. Okay. Okay. Too much, too much. Oh, Sugi. I have a feeling my shaving will hurt more than actual laser. It's <laughs> this, this razor is too weak. Did it? Did it? Did it? It kind of hurts, but okay. That is. I think it's just in my mind, so I feel like it's burning, but it's not. It doesn't feel bad. I feel like it doesn't burn or feel hot or anything, so I think it's okay. Maybe the higher level you go, the worse it feels. I'm at level 2, and I would say there's a tiny, very, very tiny prick of heat. So there you go. Um, Of course, there's... You can tell there's no hair here because it was shaved off, but there's no red marks, it didn't burn. Since this is my first time making this video, maybe I'll make an update video like a couple of months later. 
now there's 499,956 shots left. This is zero. What do you do? Okay. So apparently once that half a million zaps are done, uh, you basically throw this machine away. Uh, I don't know exactly. One thing that's not listed in here, it doesn't say how many times you should zap yourself each session. That's one thing I don't understand about this thing, but um, I would assume but between 10 and 30 times. Um, it didn't hurt. There was, I felt a slight, I would say a slight prick every time we squeezed it, but I don't know if that was just in my head or I was really like getting zapped. 500,000 zaps and we're down to 499,966 or something. So we used about 44 between the two of us today. So I guess once this runs out, it's kind of a useless product but it should be a long time before it runs out especially if you're just using it on your own rather than sharing it thank you hello moto hello moto both sides hello moto um this product is interesting it actually looks pretty high high level it's pretty sturdy um it doesn't look it doesn't feel like ghetto it feels nice and strong and i like the display screen everything looks really cool i think they need to do a little bit more with their training manual the japanese manual maybe more a little bit possibly color for the skin tone and more information like how many times you should um, zap yourself that was a really good product it's cute domo it feels good it's like i guess the same weight as a hair dryer Oh, 460 grams there you go so it's about the same as a uh, hairdryer yeah and uh, I like that you can plug into the wall um, and that you don't have to like keep it charged or anything you just plug it in and use it and then stop using it you can unplug it um, definitely they need a better razor so I would say don't use this um, use your own razor especially if you don't have really fine hair I don't know much about this product or about laser rem hair remover surgery or these machines so um, we can't really compare it to other brands maybe some other brands might be better but I'm pretty impressed with what they send me and this looks like it's a pretty good deal so I will leave the link for the for this product in the information section I'd like to say thank you for Mayu Arigato gozaimasu for helping me with the Japanese translation stuff and for being a guinea pig with her leg. She will probably use it more than I do. So oh, hopefully in the next couple of months we'll let you know what happened, the outcome of if the hair stopped growing or not. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, thumbs up and share. Um, leave any comments you want. Uh, if you ever tried this or other companies, let me know what you think or if you have any advice because I've never used this. If you have any advice on how to use this, please let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Thanks to Hello Moto. And uh, see you in the next video. Let's do peace. Shh. Peace. How do I look? Very good. Don't take me home until I'm drunk. I love you. Do, 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 do.